Hey, welcome to the show. I was sent a division problem from one of my subscribers. I always like to read the comments and they wanted this big number right here. Put a couple commas right there. 198,071 divided by five. So we're gonna be doing that on this show today. Um, we always like to practice division. Before we do that, if you can take a look at the link right up above, that is a link to my new channel called Dino Math. We're taking, uh, because we just love dinosaurs and we like mathematics, so we're putting them together and it's called Dino Math. So I'd sure appreciate, go over to that channel and uh, check it out. And uh, if you could hit that subscribe button, oh golly, I'd be so happy about that. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started here. How do I start? All right, remember, I, I start with this number right here. Can I put five into one? All right, no you can't. So I gotta move over to 19. So how many times can I put five into 19? I really like working with fives because it's just so simple. So five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So I said 15, that's five times three can go into 19. If I did five times four, that's too big, just can't do it. So we're gonna go with five times three. So I put the three right up above here and then I multiply again. So I'll take three times five equals 15. So I put the 15 right there and then I subtract, all right? So nine minus five, four. So I put the four right here and one minus one is zero. All right, just, just leave it four. Then I go over to the next number and then I just drop it down, all right? As you know, if you're watching my channel, I love to do the drop it down. <laughs> drop it down, drop it down. Put the eight right there. Don't be late, eight. Now we got 48. Again, we do multiples of five, all right? So five times five is 25, gotta go up there more. Five times eight is 40. Five times nine, 45. Five times 10 is 50, too high. Let's do it at nine. So we're gonna put the nine right here. Nine times five is 45. And again, we're going to subtract. Eight minus five, three. And then I bring the next number down. Another reason why I always make those little squiggly marks is so that I can keep track of, if I'm dealing with a big number like that, I just can keep track a little better. I don't know if you can even find this in a math workbook or a teacher tells you to do it, but I just like to do it. So just right down here and put a zero. All right, my zero looked like a six at first. And I also make that squiggly line just um, so it doesn't look like a one. Later on, you know, when you're working with mathematics, you'll be able to, you might be able to just not have to put that little squiggly line in there, but it's great to just start out with, so it's good practice. So we got 30, all right? So how many times does five go into 30? Six, all right, so I'm gonna put six right here. Six times five is 30, subtract zero. Now, you could put the zero there, but there's no reason, it, it, zero. So now I drop the next number down. <laughs> drop it down, drop it down, ooh, ooh, ooh. Drop it down, <laughs> all right. So again, how many times can I put five into seven right there? Hmm, I one time, we can only put one time. So I put one times five is five right here. Seven minus five equals two and then we drop the next number down. So drop it all the way down here. Boom, there. So how many times can I put five into 21? Five, 10, 15, 20. I better do the other fingers. <laughs> four times. So I put the four right here. Four times five is 20. Subtract, and we have a one. I don't know if you can see that. Way down there, way at the bottom of the of the screen there, a one. I can't put five into one. There's no more numbers to drop down. That is my remainder. So I'm gonna put a remainder right here, it's R1. Remainder of one. That's it. Easy, cheesy, lemon squeezy. Hey, if you like practicing math, check out more of my videos here on Lampo Film. I also have another channel called The Learning Fun Show. Uh, look it down, 
down there in the description. And like I said, I'm trying to get that one channel started. It's called Dino Math. I'm just having so much fun with that because we love playing with dinosaurs. Um, yeah, so it's a, just a fun time. I hope you're out there having fun this, uh, these days, getting out and exercising. And uh, I hope your family's doing well. And we'll talk to you later. Thanks a lot for watching the show. Adios. Goodbye.